Hi and welcome to my random ruminations. So today we're going to do a little review. This is a headset that I got on my birthday in March with my Nokia 625. It's a Lumia, it's a actually pretty good smartphone. Surprisingly, considering these were free and are fuck ugly in this color, these are a very good set of headphones. Um, they're made by a company called Collode, C-O-L-O-U-D, Collaud, Collaud, and they're called The Boom. Now, I don't know if they deserve the word, the name The Boom, and I'm covered in dog hair again. Mm. I don't know if they're, they deserve the name The Boom, but I will say this. These are equally as good as my Skullcanty Lowriders. And in some very important ways, they're better. The main way that these... Uh, sound quality, they're as good as my, as my Lowriders. Full stop. They just are. These have a frequency range of 20 to 20... to, 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 to 20,000 hertz. Um, they're, they're actually quite good. Um, I mostly use these with my tablet for Skyping from my tablet and for watching YouTube when I want to be able to hear something really clearly, which I can. A um, few things about them. They're pretty sturdy. Uh, the flexibility on this is... One of the problems I've always had with on-ear overhead band headphones is that when I put them on they move around on my head forward or back but these I actually can't get these to shake off I can't my low riders if I did that those would be on the floor with my low riders if I bend over to pick up something I then have to bend over again to pick up my low riders with these not a problem now yes these are an ugly color but that's because Nokia only had options on yellow, blue, and red. That's it. Cloud themselves sell these online for €25.99. Euros. I don't know what the postage is, but it's going to vary depending on where you are anyway. And on their website, these are available, I think, on about 10 different color schemes. I have my eyes on a really, really sickeningly cute purple and pink colouring scheme where it's like dark a purple and then pink on the it's, they're just lovely and I'm actually gonna buy myself a second set of these. Why? These are pretty soon gonna be stationed permanently with my PC for when I'm recording. Uh, when I'm recording gameplay and uh, for when I'm editing because I find an over a headset is much better. It gives me a much better idea of what the sound actually sounds like. But my lowriders are coming to the end of their lifetime. They're my second set in four years. I'm getting about two years per set of, of lowriders. Low I'm not sure how these will compare, but when you consider that lowriders are about 40 euros, the sound is only just as good. They're, mot, they're not much less comfortable. These are extremely comfortable. Lowriders, I wear them for half an hour and my ears start getting sore very very sore actually now that might be particular to the shape of my ears but i have heard one or two other people complain about that that skull candy low riders they can make the pinna of your ear quite sore and tender i've actually ended up with bruises here from my low riders not a problem with these these are extremely comfortable and that's a big concern for me they have one other feature which i really really like and that's this little hole right here, you wrap them around your fingers like so, and then you put the connector through, oh, this is awkward a little bit, and then you actually push that through the hole, and it stops them from getting tangled. I mean, it's such a simple little idea, but it's brilliant. These do not get tangled in your bag if you do that. Now, admittedly, it does mean you have to do that. But even at that, just because of the shape of the, co the cable, which is this kind of ribbon cable, they're not prone to get entangled at all. Also, the fact that it's a single thread without a second one coming out, and, well, you can see what I'm getting at. 
I can't recommend these highly enough at the price point. If these were even five euros more, I would say no. Don't go and get something a bit better. But if you want a budget headset that is in the 25 euro mark price mark that is light and they are very light there uh, according to their website they're 132 grams that is extremely light my low riders are heavier now admittedly mine are an older model low riders and the newer ones may be lighter but my low riders are 170 grams these are 132 they're not flimsy at all these have been kicked dropped stood on chewed by a dog uh, peed on by a dog actually this part not this part um, they have not been cleaned apart from cleaning the pee off in the in the few months that I've had them since March and this is now November so eight months eight months and as you can see they're still pretty much immaculate uh, they work extraordinarily well with the Lumia phones really really well they could have been designed for them they work extraordinarily well as well with my transformer prime my asus transformer prime just so good with that the sound quality is exquisite the uh, well for a tablet the they work extremely well on skype they actually do work on skype with my transformer i don't know if they're supposed to but they do as you can see they're a standard 3.5 millimeter connector and um it's a standard microphone connector. So they're a headset, but they're also a microphone. As you can see, they have a multi-function button here. I'm not really sure how what it can be used for. I know it'll pause uh, on my tablet, it pause the Skype calls, which is actually pretty cool. Um, so yeah, if you want a really budget set of headphones, like say for a child for their tablet or for their, um, for their DS or other portable system they're ideal they're also very child friendly colors and they're very very child friendly in that they're comfortable and they don't really have any sharp edges they're just awesome just freaking awesome so um, yeah I'm gonna call it a day there if you want a set of these go for them they are I will put a link to the company website in the description for this video. They are well worth getting, get them. I am going to head off and play some Minecraft for a while, and I mean actually play it, not record it, because um, I have an idea, I need to test it. Um, Torchlight will be going up in, I think, about an hour. Maybe it's either an hour or two. Anyway, it's soon. Uh, I hope you enjoy watching that. Um, I may chat to you tomorrow. It depends. Me and video blogging on Sundays are kind of, we have kind of a hinky relationship. Um, but in the meantime, have a lovely Saturday. Uh, enjoy your weekend. And I will talk to you all soon. Bye.